Welcome back. Today I am going to show you how to use OpenAI's DAL-E API for generating and editing images. But before we dive in, please support my channel by subscribing and giving this video a thumbs up. Let's get started. The first thing you need to do is open your browser and search for OpenAI API. Then click the first link that comes up. Once you are here, create an account and then log in. Once you have logged in, go to dashboard and then API keys. Now here you need to create a new secret key. Give it a name. Now once the key is created, copy this new key and save it somewhere because you won't be able to access it again. The next step is to install Python OpenAI package on your terminal. Type pip3 install OpenAI and hit enter. I had it already installed in my system. Let's set up our code. First, we'll import the OpenAI library as shown here. Next, we need to set up our OpenAI client object by plugging in the API key that we created in the first step. Let's start with image generation now. On your OpenAI account, click on Docs. Then click on Image Generation. Here you will find all the information about image generation and image editing. You will see a code snippet here. We will just copy this snippet and use it in our project. Now we paste our code here. As we can see, the model is selected as DAL E3 by default. Currently, that's the best model for image generation. We can also try other models like DAL E2 if we wish. We then specify the prompt describing the image we want to generate. I specify a dog walking on the moon. The size is set to 1024 x 1024. The quality by default is standard, but we can set it to HD if we wish. The parameter n specifies the number of images we want to generate. To get the image URL from the response, I type image URL equals response.data its first index dot URL. Then I print the URL. Let's run this code. Now I see the image URL. I open it in the browser and this is the image that got generated. It looks pretty good. Let's try something else now. I change the prompt to a cute dog swimming in the middle of the ocean. Let's see what it generates. Okay, this is the image it generates. It looks a bit cartoonish, but it's still good. Now, let's move on to generating image variations. We copy the code snippet from the documentation and paste it in our project. Just a note, at the time of making this video, this feature is currently available for DAL-E2 model only, but it may be available for DAL-E3 and future models soon. We need to provide the path to an image file for which we want to create variations. I have a file named cutedog.png. The file looks like this. Also, another important note. The file provided must be a PNG file and should be less than 4 MB. Let's generate three variations. So I set n equals 3. Now I print those image URLs. Instead of printing it separately, you can also loop through the URLs. Let's run the code. So it shows me three URLs. These are the images that got generated. These are pretty decent variations of the original image. We can see the dog's ear is raised and there are different backgrounds. Next, we try to edit images. This process is also known as image inpainting. Basically, we need to provide two images, the original image and the mask of the original image. The mask is essentially the same image but with a transparent area where we want to perform our edit. Let me show you how it's done. I have a simple image of a swimming pool. I'll create a transparent area using an image editor. You can use any software like GIMP, Photoshop, or in my case, Krita. 
first i open the image in trita then i set the eraser tool click on preserve alpha and set the opacity to 100% i use the eraser tool to create a small transparent area in the swimming pool next i save the image now i copy the code snippet from the documentation just a note at the time of making this video this feature is only available for dal e2 model i provide the path to the image as well as the image mask Let's give a prompt describing our edit. I provide a dog swimming in the pool. Okay, since we have tried dog images previously, let's try something different. Instead of a dog, I'll try a tiger swimming in the pool. Now, let's generate our image. So, this is the image that gets generated. The edit doesn't always seem perfect, but we can experiment with different prompts and settings. OpenAI has stopped providing free credits to use its API. So we need to add credits to continue using their services. To do this, go to your OpenAI account, click on settings, and then billing. Here you can check if you have any credits. If not, you will need to add some credits using your credit card. You just need two to three dollars to get started. You can find this code in the link provided in the description. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, just hit the subscribe button now. I would also love to see the cool images you generate using the DAL E API. Share the links to the images you generate in the comment section. Thank you guys.